And now, a special message from this year's Men's Retreat guest speaker, a real man's man, Dr. Sandy Good, who will be speaking to us on being mighty men of prayer during our three-day retreat at Twin Pines on November 21st through the 23rd. Take one. Oh, good, uh, good afternoon or good morning, whatever it is. I lose track of things down here in my study. I'm just down here reading one of my favorite books, reading the good book about, uh, about life. Uh, understand uh, there's going to be a men's retreat coming up. And, uh, well, I'll just tell you, I'm, I'm really looking forward to coming. Uh, I really haven't prepared anything. Cut and, uh, Take two. Yeah, as I was saying before, I was kind of rudely cut off there. Uh, I'm looking forward to being on this men's, uh, men's retreat, I guess. And, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to uh, hearing what I'm going to say. I've uh, been preparing. My whole life has been one big preparation. Uh, preparation H, they used to call it. Cut. Uh, back. Let's try to stay on message. Take three. Hi, good, good evening. It's evening now down here in my office. I've been down here working all day preparing for this men's retreat that's coming up. Uh, looking forward to it. Uh, uh, hopefully some of you men will get out. Uh, I wonder how old this beef jerky is. Rolling, take 23. Take 23. <laughs> yeah, back, back to this men's retreat. I'm looking forward to being there. And I, well, well, quite frankly, I, I've had some issues with your pastor, and I, I'm hoping he, he doesn't show up. I, I can't stand the guy. I mean, he married my daughter, and, well, I just haven't forgiven him for that. I, cut! Uh, what do you mean, cut? I, I'm trying to be honest here. You want me to... Take 28. Oh, oh, good evening. Uh, again, I'm uh, just down here in my study. I come down here a lot, do a lot of study, and you can see from the books in the background, I'm a, well, in the toilet seat too, but uh, books especially, I come down here, do a lot of studying, and whatever. I'm looking forward to this men's retreat. I'm going to be doing some manly stuff up there. I got, got uh, hatchets and axes down here, maybe do some wood splitting and stuff, and shot myself a female elephant. Uh, might bring this along. Probably bigger than any old white-tailed deer any of you men shot. It's beef turkey's good. Jack Link's, it's the best. Let's try to get this tape 32. Well, good evening. Uh, glad to be here with you. And uh, I am looking forward to being on this men's retreat to, uh, up at Twin Pines. And uh, the topic we agreed on or talked about was uh, prayer uh, being mighty men of prayer. Uh, it just seems to me more and more, uh, maybe historically, I don't know, but there were, when I was growing up in our church, there were women's Bible studies and kind of women's prayer group and women's prayer meetings and stuff, and sometimes it just seems like, well, prayer, prayer's for the women, but uh, there's an awful lot of God's Word on prayer, and it, it just seems to me that men, maybe especially men, need to unite together in prayer and cry out to God uh, for the things that are concerns that are going on in this world and also in our own lives and our church and, and in, in our own area where we live. So uh, I'm looking forward to it. I think we'll all learn together, maybe even do some prayer, praying together. Might be somewhat vulnerable to be honest in our prayers before God, but that's how God wants us to be. And I think uh, the retreat, uh, just because of the topic, I guess, will change your life and hopefully ch change the church in a positive way, Lancaster County, maybe even the world as God, uh, the mighty God that we pray to, uh, works and responds to our prayers. And have some beef jerky. Perfect, that's a wrap. Finally! It's a